Hello YouTube, Bushcraft Woods Devil here. I thought I'd talk to you today about a piece of equipment my uh, wife and kids gave me a while back. It's a um, collapsible three-piece uh, axe. They gave this to me as a gift and uh, I've used it a little bit here and there. And I thought I'd show it off today and talk about it. So what you have here is um, a carrying pouch, the axe head, I've painted this one green just to touch it up. It's uh, threaded. I carry uh, some tinder, there's a hollow cavity inside the head here and I carry some uh, jute tied with a string so I can draw it out. Took a lot of work. It was uh, it was quite dull when it arrived and I put a usable edge on it. And the way this goes together you just uh, thread the handle into the, the head these are extruded steel with a rubber hand grips. One thing I've found is you really got to tighten it up. It will work. It's way loose with uh, heavy use. These are sometimes marketed as a uh, commando axe. Uh, I think that's just some clever sales uh, name there. So you have a, you can use it two-handed or you can choke up on it. It's uh, it's really probably not meant for super hard use. You can process uh, some light kindling with it. I like to carry it in my vehicle. I know some people are probably looking at this and going Get a real axe. What are you wasting your time with that? Well, you know, not everything has to be uh, death and taxes. You can just have some fun. If you see something and you like it and it makes you happy, buy it, use it. Um, or what about people who can't afford a 30 or fifty or hundred dollar axe. Um, I personally I think if you like a piece of equipment buy it, use it, enjoy it. Whatever gets you outdoors. Um, and again if you can't afford better why let money prevent you from getting outdoors and having some fun. You buy what you can, save for something better in the meantime, get outdoors and get some experience. One thing I've done with uh, this head is you can make uh, shavings. Got some uh, fat wood here, and um, you can just detach the head. And you can make fire starting shavings very easily. I'm sure you can make a feather stick. It's almost like a ulu when it's detached. Just be sure to cut away from yourself. Don't want to self inflict a nasty cut. So just uh, just a little tool we can use. So uh, let's go outside and make a fire. <laughs> 